Hi everyone, it's very nice to have you here. I'm Aris from CFM, and I'm gonna host this episode for you. Hope you can enjoy the time. And today's topic is finding the fabric. I think some of you may encounter such a situation when you are decide to get an item for event or marketing display, and you may raise some of the following questions. What type of fabric for this item is most suitable? Which fabric is better for outdoor use? I need to use it in a windy place. Which fabric do I need to choose? These questions are frequently asked by our customers, especially since CFM offers a wide selection of fabrics. Therefore, some basic knowledge of fabrics is needed if you want to get the answers for those questions. So what we share here today is how to choose the most suitable fabric to meet your new requirements. And I'm going to share it in third parts, classification of fabric names, easier way for choosing by CFM, and the specific case for flag and banner. Okay, I would like to start with the classification of fabric names to help you distinguish the fabrics I have simply divided into three types, named with D, named with G, and named with features. Let's go with the first one, named with D of Daniel. Daniel is a unit of measurement used to determine the fiber thickness of individual threads or filaments used in the creation of textiles and fabrics. Fabrics with a high Daniel count tend to be thick sturdy and durable, such as 100 Daniel polyester, 600 Daniel polyester. And clearly, 600 Daniel polyester is thicker than 100 Daniel polyester. The second one is named with G of GSM. GSM is a metric measurement, meaning grams per square meter. It's how much one square meter of fabric weighs. And the higher the GSM number, the denser the fabric will be. A piece of lightweight fabric is typically between 30 to 150 grams. Medium weight is about 150 grams to 350 grams. And the heavy weight is heavier than 350 grams. What we have like 110 grams midi polyester, 240 grams tension fabric, and the first one is a lightweight fabric for the standard use, while the second one is a medium weight fabric for longer time use. And the last classification of fabric names is named with features. You might see that some names of the fabric may also contain the most distinctive feature of the fabric, such as friend retardant, high density, fluorescent yellow, waterproof, blackout, elasticity, and so on. You can also judge from these descriptive words. Regarding the fixtures, a necessary reminder here is some functional fixtures are a relative concept. For example, UV protected is one of the fixtures for 600 Daniel PO polyester, and it's not referring to the fabric will never fading out. But the color on this fabric will last longer than other standard fabrics. Now, some of you may have a preliminary idea of fabrics, but having to make a decision for so many options every time, it's kind of a hassle, right? So if you check our website and you will see that we have done some work in advance to help you save time and order more conveniently. The first one is to filter ahead and reduce the options. For most products, we do not offer all fabrics as an option. You may only see one or a few options because CFM has eliminated the inappropriate fabrics and selected the most suitable ones for the product based on our full experience in the past decade. And the second word is labeled the hot option. This is based on the purchase preferences of all our customers. Fabrics with hot labels are the most popular among our customers. 
which can basically mean 90% of their needs. So if you have no idea about the fabrics, you can go with the hot label option directly. And the next word is detailed information. We provide detailed information for each fabric, including picture, printing method, width, weight, and features. You just need to click the fabric option, then you will see it. And I think this information can help you make a good choice when you are hesitating between several fabrics. The third part of today's topic is the specific case for flags and banners. Although we did the above words to help you make the decision easier, for flag and banner, there are still many options that might confuse you. So I want to share some specific cases of fabrics here. First of all, two hot label options, 100 Daniel polyester and 110 grams midi polyester. They are the most common fabrics. And the difference is that 110 grams midi polyester is more suitable for outdoor use than 100 Daniel polyester. But for indoor activities, short-term use, or like the hand flag for big promotion with great demand, 100 Daniel polyester is a better choice. Well, 110 grams midi polyester can be widely used for any standard situation, no matter it's an indoor or outdoor event. Both of them have a good penetration, so even with single-sided printing, the backside of flag can still see the logo well. And the next one is 120 grams mesh polyester. You can tell from its name like the fabric has mesh, right? Named with the feature as we talked above. Based on its fabric feature, it has good ventilation and is therefore suitable for some windy places. It's also a common fabric for fence banner. So if you have similar needs, go with it directly. Another one I would like to talk about is 600 Daniel PU polyester. It's actually our standard fabric for the tent. But if you require a specific purpose for banner, like outdoor use with sun explosion, durable enough for long-term use, then it's also a good option for banners. Of course, based on the information we talked about, the price may also be one of the factors that affect your selection. So you can also make the decision under the price and the budget. 100 Daniel polyester is the most economical fabric for flex and banners. So for large orders, it can help you reduce the cost. As for the 110 grams mini polyester, I think it's most cost effective for usual use. The last one I would like to bring here today is a fabric swatch. What better way to distinguish than to touch and feel the fabrics by yourself? We offer the fabric swatch book for every customer who registered on CFM online store. One piece is limited to each customer and one cent for each book as a support. And you only need to afford the shipping cost to get the CFM fabric swatch book. This can also ship with your other CFM orders together to help you save the shipping cost. Okay, that's all I want to share for today. Thank you for attending this webinar. It's an honor to be here with you. And I really hope that this information can help you get to know the fabrics and convenient for your order with CFM. If you still have any further questions about fabric selection, please feel free to email us or contact us via online chat on CFM website. You can see the information on the screen. Thanks again for your valuable time and hope to see you next time. Bye-bye.